Digital analysis of movement is typically done in an expensive university laboratory with a six to eight camera system in a large room, accompanied by scientists who put reflector balls on the body to help computers estimate where the body parts are. Using Movement Lab 3D recording, we can see the reflector balls placed on the body in a laboratory. These are used to estimate the bones and the joints during a movement. The Kinect software attempts to estimate the body parts and it does a reasonable job. In fact, research has shown that it is good enough for training and rehabilitation. However, if you look closer at the knees and the ankles, you can see that the Kinect joints do not necessarily represent the real joints. Therefore, Quinematic has spent four years making software that tracks the body much closer to the gold standard movement lab. The purple dots represent the Quinematic tracking, which is much closer to the markers in the laboratory. The yellow dots represent the Kinect, and as you can see, the ankles and knees look very different indeed. That's why we can confidently say that Quinematic is the new standard for markerless motion capture, allowing everybody access to good quality objective measurement of movement without going to an expensive university laboratory. Quinematic records 3D video of how people move so that we can make accurate estimates about posture, balance and movement patterns. We've managed to track the body parts using a basic off-the-shelf sensor so that everybody can get access to these types of measurements without actually booking into the lab and meeting a professor. At Quinematic we think it's very important to compare body parts during a single movement. It's not really telling the whole picture if you just look at the knees. You need to look at the shoulders and how they behave. You also need to look at the feet and the center of mass. We use these tracking points to plot your posture. The shoulders, the head, the trunk, the hips, the knees and the ankles. We can also see something called the plumb line by projecting a line up from the ankles to the knees, to the hips, to the shoulders and to the head. If we look at this person's squat on the right leg, it becomes very clear how important it is to not only track the knee accurately as it goes inwards and downwards, but also to observe the compensation strategies, the way this person prevents themselves from falling over. As the knee goes in, the shoulders tip to the right, and we really need to measure that, capture it, and do it accurately. Another important feature of optimal human movement is good balance. The ability to keep your center of mass over your base of support. The relationship between the center of mass and the base of support is often observed best from the floor view or from the helicopter view, which is very difficult to do by an individual just observing a person from the front. At Quinematic, we like to say, if you're not assessing, then you're just guessing.